there, it's Elena Bear. Today I'm going to show you how I transform one outfit into two totally different looks for day and night simply by changing my accessories, my hair, and my makeup. This video is part one, the daytime look. Here is the dress I've chosen to wear. It's a lacy blue tiered dress from JCPenney that's very versatile. Now I'm going to be starting off my daytime makeup by applying primer and foundation. Um, as always, the products that I use will be listed in the description box below, so be sure to check that out if you want to know exactly what I'm putting on my face. So I'm just blending in my foundation in super speed, because you don't need to see all the details of that. Next, I'm putting on my concealer just under my eyes and on any red spots I have on my face. I'm using e.l.f.'s Tone Correcting Powder, and clearly I really like this stuff because it's almost gone. So I put that on before I put on regular powder just to even out my skin tone a little bit. Now I am putting on the powder, which is a lot um, heavier than the Tone Correcting Powder, so I do like to put on a regular powder as well. And I'm using e.l.f.'s Bronzer. First I start out with the highlighter, and I put that on the top of my cheekbones, and then I blend the other three colors together and put those underneath my cheekbones and on my temples. This is my favorite blush. It's from Physicians Formula. I absolutely love it, and I'm just going to be putting that on my cheekbones pretty heavily because I love me some blush. Next I'm going to fill in my eyebrows with this CoverGirl eyebrow pencil and I'm just going to get rid of the excess and just kind of tame them up with that brush because I do have pretty crazy eyebrows. Brushing them out, brushing them out. This takes so long. <laughs> Next, I'm going to line my waterline with this Rimmel eye pencil in Nude. And I just love this. This is my new obsession. It looks amazing. It looks better than white. Now I'm priming my eyelids to get ready for the eye makeup. Since it's a daytime look, I'm going with pretty basic colors. I'm using Stila's Kitten Duo. And I'm going to take that darker color in the duo and put that all over my lid. It's so pretty. Then I'm taking the lighter color in the Kitten Duo and using that as my highlight. Now I'm taking the Stila Palette Volume 1, The Minimalist, and I'm going to be putting that sort of medium brown color on the inner corners of my eyes and in the crease to add dimension. Now I'm using a fluffy brush to blend that out so it's not so harsh because this is a daytime look. I don't want it to be too crazy or intense. Now applying this Stila eyeliner. I just realized that like all of the products are Stila. <laughs> I'm sorry about that, but they're amazing. So I love this Stila eyeliner. This is brown and now I'm going to curl my eyelashes and apply mascara. So this is my favorite lip liner by Rimmel. It's pretty much my skin color and it just is like a nice accent. My mouth looks so crazy when I put on lip products. I don't know why I can't look like a normal person. Anyway, there is the finished makeup look now. So let's move on to hair. I'm going to take this clip out of my hair, brush it a little bit. And I don't want to do anything too crazy because, you know, it's the morning, you're going to go to school or work, and you don't want to spend too much time in your hair. So I'm just teasing it a little bit, which is totally optional. It's just my hair gets so heavy and it's just kind of flat around my face. So I'm teasing it a little bit. Then I'm just going to do a really quick side braid. It takes like seconds to do this. And it's nice and cute, but it's also really casual and fast. I'm 
just tying that off with a little clear elastic and I was just really nervous that you guys wouldn't be able to see it so I had to make sure <laughs> that's what it is guys <laughs> So there is me in the dress, hair and makeup is done, and the earrings are the same color. They're from Walmart. They're just basic navy blue earrings. This watch I got from Steinmart, which is kind of similar to TJ Maxx and Ross and Marshalls. This white ring was um, actually from my friend, so I have no idea where she got it, but I mean, you can get things like that almost anywhere. I just think it's really cute and that is all the jewelry now I'm gonna be putting on this belt I got from rue 21 I think it's so cute and it just goes with so many different things since it's still kind of chilly here it is spring but it is kind of chilly so I'm going to be putting on this cardigan over top of the dress just for the daytime as well I'm going to be putting on some leggings some brown leggings and finishing off the look with these brown boots from Target. I absolutely love them. So this is the finished cold day kind of wintry look. And now I'm gonna show you guys sort of a warm, like if you live in a warmer climate or if it's a warmer day, I would wear ballet flats and no sweater or leggings. So this is option number two for the daytime look. You could just go with just ballet flats and no sweater. This is how the outfit would look on a warmer spring day. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and be sure to watch part two where I show you how I transform this look into a nighttime look just by altering my hair and my accessories and makeup. Thanks for watching.